Hey everyone, I'm Granhol, and welcome back to Let's Play the Dishwasher, Dead Samurai! Dead Samurai! So, now it's time to go to Camcor! Der. Haha, -ha, see what I just did there? I made a joke! I just pretended that we're going to a level named after a camera thing. 151... Oh, fine, I'll increase my max health. Jeez. And not by much, either. Dang. Well, cyborgs didn't really kill my sister. They, they kind of changed her into a ninja and then had me kill her. So, yeah. And that's still not how synthesis is spelled. It's spelled with a Y. So it's more sign thesis. Ah! Ow! Wow. Okay. Ow. I'm not liking this guy's, uh,. Yeah, I'm not liking this guy's homing electric missile attacks. They are not, uh, they are not a thing I like. Or his electric shockwaves, for that matter. However, I seem to be doing pretty well against him. So... What? Well, I guess I shouldn't be complaining too much. And then I just climb on his head and hack him to pieces. I'm really hoping this wasn't the final boss. And I smash my TV, according to this achievement. And moving on. Possibly up maybe to the uh, Upper East Side. There might even be a deluxe apartment in the sky involved. You know, anything's possible. Have I mentioned lately how much I don't trust empty rooms? <laughs> So, this guy with the skull face is the Fallen Engineer. And this guy I'm going to be beheading. Oh, hey! He's the guy who was on the horse. Who I stole the shift blade from. And now he's got, like, Captain Kuro claws. And I can lock him into a combo of getting hit with the chainsaw, it would appear. When I'm not getting blasted all over the place by his seeking electrical missiles. Inventory uber fishes. And so I am dismembering him and then taking his head. And that is not all. Great. Well, you know, I'm, I'm glad that I'm glad that, uh, that kind of meager boss fight isn't the entirety of the final boss, but even so, I'm not a huge fan of one-winged angel bosses.
Ow. Now slashing his throat because cutting into him has proven to be so effective in the past. The chef is dead? Wait, when did I see him get chopped in two? <laughs> so now this is a team-up battle for the rest of the boss fight? Excellent! And... I win. Because I just shoved my cleavers into the fallen engineer's chest. Like you do. I, I don't have to fight the chef now, do I? I, I really hope I don't have to fight the chef now. Nope, he just jumped into the sky. Level complete. Final boss defeated? That was another really short level. So. Credits? Well. Uh, <laughs> this was... This was a fun game. It, that... There was that one boss that I really did not approve of, but... Apart from him, yeah, I, I, I kind of dug this game. Definitely gonna have to play uh, Vampire Smile at some point. I imagine that between Dead Samurai and Vampire Smile, the dishwasher gets uh, depowered somewhat. Oh, he's thanking his mom and dad. Isn't that cute? And he's thanking Evil Dead, but spelled incorrectly. Huh. So, anyway, yeah, um, fun game. And of course he's thanking God. Yeah. No comment. So, yeah, soon we're going to be playing a new game, like, in just a couple of days a new game video is going to go up, because that's just how these things work, you know. I finish one game and I start a new one. It's, just, it's, it's what you do. So, it's what I'm going to do. I mean, you can't just call off gaming in general because you finished a game. That would be terrible. I mean, back in the 80s, if they were like, Well, I finished Super Mario Brothers. I'm going to stop playing video games now. That would be terrible. And I go with Super Mario Brothers because it's one of the earlier games to have an actual ending. Well, I suppose there's adventure before that, but... The Atari was really before my time. So, I can't really comment on that. And, uh, yeah. Ska Studios is thanking me for playing. Well, I hope that game wasn't too unenjoyable for you guys. But, uh, it's over now. It's over. I'm Granhol. See you guys next time.